Good day, my name is Doug, I'm running 7 Days to Die, Alpha 19, stable version. I have switched from my multi, or from my server to a straight uh, running off my PC. Um, it seems to have resolved some of the, the lag issues. <coughs> this is a custom generated uh, uh, map. I actually spent the last several hours doing it. Yeah, it was pretty insane. I am desperate for wood right now, so this is what we're going to start our day off with. stream sorry you get to watch this but so far as the youtubers go we're gonna go ahead and pause this I might collect like three trees and then we're gonna go look at the uh, <coughs> the quest I got from the trader yesterday well it would appear that I attracted some attention so take care. remember they take more damage when they're down so that is definitely the time to use this attack. I'm waiting for my... Here we go. Okay. And he's in rage mode. Well, I've stumbled across a guy, and that takes care of him. But while I'm here, okay, I've been making these again. Yeah, I know I'm go crazy over frames, but they are so darn handy. And I forgot to pick these up last night, so we'll go ahead and do these right now as well. I'm just gonna be dropping stuff off. That way I'm not hauling things all over. I thought there was another oh there it is. There we go. Okay. So boiled water, I actually should bring that with me. Having some water along is a good thing. Okay. That's all the foodstuffs and then melties. I wanna want that. Let's go ahead and grab these. And make me some more arrows. And then we'll just go ahead and leave the rest behind. Oh right, explosive stuff. That would be saltpeter because you make gunpowder out of that. Oil. Brass. And there is glass. And then this stuff stays here. That and that, yeah, I know it. 
watching someone else do inventory maintenance is the worst. I should have paused it. And we have company along the way. And so much for the company. Mailboxes are great to check. Mostly it's just paper, but hey, you never know. Whoa, wait a second. Just suddenly realized I have two quests going. Nope, it is this one. Okay. Really? Oh, this could be interesting. I would expect this fetch to, fetch to be in a building. And I didn't think there were any buildings over here. So this is either a standalone house or it's a uh, extension of the town that I wasn't aware of. Of course, it's a new map. How can I be aware of anything? But I did not think there's anything over here. It could also be a separate town. Oh, look. Okay. <laughs> I let it get too close. on that road. Looks like there's some. And no honey in that one. But no, for the most part, there's nothing there. So, this is going to be a standalone. stuff. Because when I need it, I'll need to be able to find it. Now, they've added some new terrain features. I mean, these hills are kind of cool. They're a pain to go through, but they're kind of cool. some honey with that one. And woke up a zombie. Where are you? Huh. Biker? Miner. Kind of hard to tell. If it's a biker, he's going to be tough. I need to pick this plant. Oops. Oh, and now he's in rage mode. Come on at me, buddy. Okay. That was a biker. And that would be the quest. It's a house, which will be good. I need food. I also need to get a... I've been in the 
Bird's house before. Okay. I only have one rock. Okay, so definitely need more rocks. Because I need the sledgehammer fixed to... There's a rock. Well, may not be the best way to go in, but I guess that's what we're going to do. So, we'll start back here. First thing I saw was this right here. Okay, well, it looked like a spot. a grim story right there. Okay. Well, that's it. We'll leave that be. So I do tend to go through these twice. Once before I start the quest and then once after. Every time you start the quest, it starts the uh, POI off fresh. behind those pictures. Oh, crud. Yep. There we go. Okay, what do we have here? Padded leg armor. Okay, that gives me chest and leg now. some lockpicks. Let's see if they work. <laughs> safes are always good. You find guns and safes. Although this is kind of early in the uh, 
the cycle for guns. Oh crud, I hate this. Yep. I think that's all of them. God, I do not have the, the rocks to repair. So, we're going to have to leave that for right now. Better bow. That's a primitive bow. That's a primitive bow. But this is going to have better hit points. Or whatever. <laughs> Not hit points, but it'll last longer. Food, yay. Yeah, medical equipment. Yep, somebody in there. Canned food. Here's some canned food. Yay. Wrench, possibly. Nope, but a cooking pot. That's good. That's going to go back home with me. Okay, let's see what's in here. I'm now encumbered. There's some more food. I will be eating all the food before I leave. Yes, it would be nice to take some back home, but I need it now. So... I'm still thirsty, so we drink the red tea. Shirt, jacket, there we go. Okay. So trash. Some more lock picks, okay. And some bullets for a gun I don't have. Oh, 
Hello. If you can hear it or not, but there are footsteps out there, so something in the area. And here we have the end of POI prize <laughs> ammunition for a gun I don't have. Okay, I can make a blunderbuss. I can find a blunderbuss. Okay. Now, a blunderbuss is a really clumsy gun. There's two no two ways about it, but it is pretty damn effective. some more food. Hang on for one sec. Start real quick. Modify. We're gonna go ahead and put some color on that. Also gets it out of my inventory. Here we go. Okay. Let's go ahead and get out of here and create a drop chest. And then we'll rerun this POI for real. This should be far enough away.
got some rock. Oh, that's right. Why don't you scrap those things? we're going to end this video and I'll pick it up when we do the second part of this uh, POI and when we do it for real. So see you in the next video. If you like what I'm doing, please leave a like. If you have a comment, either pro or con, please let me know. I'm trying to get better at this and the only way I'm going to do is to find out what you think about it. Talk to you later.